The wiring diagram is like this. First, you need to choose the right IC type and the right RGB sequence. Set this at mode 13.1 to mode 13.8. Set the IC tab. For this one, the IC is 1809 and the RGB sequence. Then go back to mode 1 to mode 28 to set the pixel number. Pixel number means totally how many pixels you need to control. For this controller, it could control one zero two four pixels in this case we only need to control 113 pixels now i want to show you the timing function of mode 13 1 to mode 38 for example i want to auto play the lighting effects in mode 2 to mode 8 at a certain time. First, go back to mode 2 to mode 8. Say I like to make the running times to be 3 each mode. 3. The defaulted running times is 5. And for the rest mode, mode 1 and mode 9 to mode 28. If you don't need this lighting effects, then you need to set the running times to be zero, like black. First, press set up. You could see the running times is five. Decrease to zero. After all the setting, with mode 1 to mode 28, go back to mode 13 1 to 13 8. Totally, it provides 8 options for timing. I will use 13 1 as an example. It has four options to set the time you need to autoplay the study effects. I will go date one. The date for today is August 9th. And I need the study effects to play at 2 255 To two fifteen six. Turn on this mode. Turn on this mode. And for the open option, please. Do use this option cautiously. If you confirm the operation of this option, all the running times of mode 1 to mode 28 will be 5 times again. Go to the safe option and confirm the operation. Now, Go to mode 39 to autoplay this effect you have set. When all the setting is finished and you enter 39 mode, the LEDs are not let up. You just need to wait for the exact time for this lighting effect to play. Now it's 
2.15.4 p.m. Each mode three times, and it will auto play for totally one minute. This lighting effect will be end at two fifteen six p.m. It ends at exactly 2.15.6.